How you doing? This is Studio Mike with my buddy G. Morpheus. If you like good music, uh, maybe you'll like this album. Uh, if you like to hear us talking, uh, here's a chance to get them both. A little bit of our album, a little bit of us. So, uh, hope you like it. New Day. What do you think about that track? It's pretty pretty jazzy, pretty sweet. Uh, obviously, we don't remember making that track, but <laughs> it turned out really well. I mean, what do you think about that one? Well, this one was a great one. <laughs> Took us uh, a little while to pick it up, but when we did, we knew we found gold, and that's what it was. Like we we make these things in like two seconds too, right? That's the thing to remember is like we just like we we start from scratch, throw some things together, and then we get bored of it. We're like, yeah, done. Uh, the second track, that's the one with the really funky bass one. So I thought the reason we put that one second was because the, the first track is pretty chill and it's got like a, a great uh, sound to it. But then we needed to really kick off the album with that that funky one. No. Not the one where I sing. That's track seven. <laughs> <It's a laughs> he has no idea what's on going on in this album. Yeah, no, the second track, yeah. Because I thought we should kick off the album after the first track. Because the first track super mellow and chill. But then we kind of need to kick it into gear. And that's why we chose the second track. Let me put it on. Yeah, so this is like our, our techno track, kind of, or like, I don't know if you wouldn't call it techno. I remember you in particular saying, yeah, man, cool, like you're doing something a little bit different. <laughs> yes, this is one of my favorite tracks. It's, uh, it reminds me of uh, Hieroglyphics and Deltron, so, or, or Muska Beats. So uh, this one... This is a good one, a good skate, skate song for sure. Yeah, this one, this one's a roller for sure. Yeah, so this one was a switch up from the last one because the last one has, no, I don't know. It's not electronic. It's not techno. I don't know exactly how you would describe that one, but hiptronic. There you go. <laughs> okay, that's it. Track three is a hiptronic track. Hiptronic. Unknown entities. Hiptronic. And then so the, why I stuck this one after that one. Originally, we had uh, track five, but I just thought this one would a natural fit next to the electronic one because this one's just so like chilled out that's why it's called the tree jam yeah this was one of the earlier tracks but this is one of the ones where you said to me you're like like don't touch that track like when you take that song home keep it as simple as possible don't add any shit of course i added in uh, the scratching but <laughs> should 
that mean? You gotta keep it simple. Yeah, this one I did. The, I did the bass line to this one. You know, you don't hear it as well on this mix, but on the, on the final mix that's on the album, I brought up the bass a little more. It's super sub. It's in like sub levels. You know what I mean? So you don't hear it as well on these speakers. But yeah, this is one of that we did two reggae songs in the same day, but we I, I erased the second one. It's around here somewhere. So someday another we're gonna have a second reggae track, but we didn't even it's not like we set out to make a reggae track. I mean that, that's the ironic thing. We don't never set out to make anything. They just turn out into whatever the fuck happens. And in the case of this song, we're like, hey wait, is this like a reggae beat? <laughs> how the hell did that happen? <laughs> oh you know how it happened. Yeah, this is a really good one for sure switch it up you know Yeah, so I wrote the lyrics to this song in the, in the cafeteria at the hospital. The lyrics for this song is just like, like I said, you know, like this is only beginning. You know, this is our first album, but this is nothing. Man, when you drop these lyrics on this, originally we just made this track together, and no lyrics on it. And Mike went home, and studio Mike went home, and it was magic. Yeah, this day. is only the beginning. Wow. You won't even know it hit ya Yeah, this is only the beginning I'm fucking drunk to face, I'm gonna get ya Yeah, this is only the beginning Oh, we've only scratched the surface Yeah, this is only the beginning Feels like we finally found our life's purpose I try not to like add too much to it once I leave, but sometimes the stuff's missing something, you know what I mean? Like We, we do these good tracks, but sometimes they're just... There's not enough to them, you know, we need a little something just to trip it out or just a little additional something. When we get together, we try and do as many tracks as we can together. But they don't have, we don't have to fully finish them. As long as you can get at least like four or five tracks done per session. I mean, I still think we should step our numbers up. <laughs> We tried to kind of switch it up a little bit from hip hop to a little bit of like rock hip hop to reggae to whatever we can do, right? So we're just getting this first album, we're just trying to give you all different styles, you know? But we're just trying to make good music. <laughs> yeah. We're trying to make, make good music, but make stuff people actually like too, you know? I mean, we're making stuff that we like. I mean, where our biggest audience is, is ourselves. Just you know, we're trying to make stuff we like. But at the end of the day, we want people to like it too. There is no manifesto. I think we're just trying to make good music. Isn't that what it comes down to? Having fun, making music. I mean, that's how it started, right? I mean, we were just literally. It wasn't until we had like amassed a so many tracks where we we're like, hey, why don't we just uh, put out an album? <laughs> There's no point, you know. I mean, we. We've got we've got so much stuff that's actually pretty good too. So what's the point? Well, at first you didn't you would, we were both let's just keep building tracks. But then we got so many. It's like it's, what's the point of sitting on this shit?
thank you for the support.